Hello everyone, Cheeks here, and I found this uh, product that uh, might be some help for some people, like me. It's called miracle Grow, the Evergreen Fertilizer Spikes. Now, what I uh, was at, I was at the store, I was at Home Depot actually, and I was looking for a product to uh, make my, these are emerald cedars that I grew along the fence line. And I had them since they were, I started planting them when they were about this high. And they were about five years old. So they haven't grown that much like I wanted them to. And someone told me to, um, they needed fertilizer to help them grow. So I said, what can I use? So I checked this out, Evergreen Spikes. And they uh, provide some uh, extra fertilizer that you just bang into the ground. So I'm going to try these out. And I hope that they work. So I'm going to give it, say, uh, till October, and then I'll do a follow-up to see if they grew any more. So there you go, fertilizer spikes. It cost me $10.48 at Home Depot. So I thought that was pretty reasonable, and you get 12 spikes. So they say you should use them in the spring and the fall. So I'm going to put one in each of the smaller ones, because the bigger ones are growing pretty good. I want the smaller ones to grow. The big hedge over here, my neighbor's grass, and they've they had that like around five, six years ago, and they were small. And look how high they grew. And now look at mine. Don't forget, these ones were already a little higher when I grew them. And I have some big ones as well, which you can't see. And I also have these ones here that I grew, which I paid more for their higher. But uh, I'm more concerned with these little guys. I want them to grow and I want them to really boost up. We're just going to open this up. That's a fertilizer spike. Actually, it looks like a hard candy or one of those dip -a sticks for you as you were kids. You know, you, you dip them in the package with all those flavors and then you licked it. Well, you can't lick these, but that's what sort of they look like. They're, they're pretty hard as well, just so you know. And then they come with a little plastic cap. And it's gonna, you stick that on top. I'm going to nail this into the ground. Now they say to apply once in early spring and once in mid-fall when the ground is soft and moist. And there's also what the little thing they're supposed to keep in mind is, this is for other trees, but it's called a drip line. So if the leaves come out to about here, come out to about here, you're supposed to measure down. They say you're only for these trees because they're small, so they're less than two feet, the drip line. So this is the, the drip line, this is like a, a branch. So it's less than two feet to here, to the bottom of the base. So you put about two feet, I'll, I'll bang it in the ground. So you use this cap, put it on top of your spike. So there's two feet. So you just take this spike, and then you bang it into the ground. Now if your drip line, as they were saying on the package, is four feet or less, so if the drip line was about four feet, you only need one spike. If it's bigger, you're gonna need two spikes. And it has a chart to help you with that. So this one's only one. So this says two feet from the center of the base of this tree, two feet. So I got two feet right here. That's two feet. And then the center, so move in a little bit, a few inches in. And then just bang it in. You're going to have to fix that one because it, it broke. <laughs> so I'll do another one. Well, that's my, there's my two feet. Just take the cap. Off this one, just put it on top, I'll put this one a little closer, as they say up to two feet, but I'm going to put it a little closer. Be a little careful with these. I probably should use a bigger hammer 
so they don't crumble or break. But that's something to keep in mind. See, it happened to me, it might happen to you. Now the one thing I forgot to do is to measure these. So right now I got measuring 56 inches. That's four feet. That's 48 and six, so four, four and a half feet. This one here has got 53 inches. So also I forgot to say that today is May the 20th. So October 20th, I'm gonna remeasure these trees. These are emerald cedars. And they haven't been growing very long, so let's see if they grow in those next few months. So I've got till October 20th. I'll try to do a little quick catch up on the October 20th. So we'll give it five months. We'll check back and see how high these grew. Hopefully they grew way over here. We'll never know, right? crumbling. Well, there's the spikes in the ground. We covered them all up. And there's that one there. So there you have it, a product I thought you guys might uh, like because everyone's got these emerald cedars. And really, they don't very grow very big and they don't cover up the fence line very well. So as a tip, if you're considering to get privacy for your fence, I would recommend to buy them bigger at the start because they take a while to grow. They may be a little cheaper, but look how much long. It's been like five, almost six years. And look, they haven't grown anything. They were only this big before. That's a lot of growing. You might want to get a hedge. And those things grow really good. And you're going to have lots of privacy. And it's going to be very quiet. So there's a trade-off. So think about it. That's your cheeks tip. Is you're going to be putting in a cedar hedge for privacy. Just think about how long it's going to take to grow and fill. And that should give you an idea. I would recommend going with the hedge. But when those get big, you're going to have to trim them. And that's the only that's the only drawback of those. They get really big fast and you have to do a lot of hedge trimming. These look kind of nice, but they don't fill the gaps very well, as you can see. So there you have it. We'll come back in about five months in October. So October 20th, we'll come back. I'll measure these and then you get an idea of how big they grew. Try it out. So have some fun outside. So live life loud, everybody. Cheers and cheeks out.